This is an image of Santa Anna, the leader of Mexico and the general in charge of the siege of the Alamo. This is the flag the Alamo defenders used to represent themselves. This is the missionary the Alamo defenders used. 180 Americans held here, plus Mexican rebels made around 300-400 soldiers. Compared to this, 6,000 Me uh, Mexican soldiers stood outside waiting to fight. Along the edges of the Alamo missionary cannons, including an 18 pound, they fired an 18 pound iron cannonball. These were the guns. Everyone used these guns. They were all musket loaded, muzzle loaders, and uh, had one fire plus a long time to reload with inaccuracy. Santa Ana had his 2,000 soldiers move in on the 13th day morning. While inside, Alamo soldiers were just waking up. As his 2,000 uh, soldiers moved in, they uh, surrounded the sides and uh, they had two waves. Three waves if you count the final one that actually breached the walls and killed everyone. While the third wave attacked, uh, artillery was finished setting up, but it was too late, and only a few were actually able to, be, were only able to be used. Two thousand out of six thousand soldiers were used in the siege. The reason for so many soldiers brought to the battlefield was because the Alamo was a major point for different routes throughout Texas. In order to take back Texas, Santa Ana had to take the Alamo and bring all his soldiers along with it. Everyone inside the Alamo was finally killed by the 2,000 soldiers that invaded. 